Yo, what's good guys? It is your boy JCJV and uh, yeah, y'all are probably wondering why my my screen where I am is is a lot smaller than, than, than it has been before. Well, I'm trying to have a setup to where um, both my music channel and my uh, video game channel um, are not, you know, clashing with each other as far as like the layout of my screen is concerned. Um, Cause yeah, I've been watching like a lot of my gameplays versus uh, my reactions and stuff. And I was trying to figure out a way, like, how can I have a layout where no matter what I do, if uh, whether it's the gameplays or the reactions or me posting my music, it's concerned, how can I have it where it's not going to clash with anything, you know? And I think I finally got the layout all figured out so it's more universal, you know what I mean, with both channels and whatnot. But anyway, not about me or, or my situation. It's about this video that we're about to get into. So... Uh, we're about to react to this video from none other than Miss Patty Lynn. Now, for those of you who may not know, uh, Miss Patty Lynn is the mother of the Ryan Upchurch. And uh, the reason I wanted to react to this video is because, I, and I already gave this a once over. Uh, apparently, she bought a house somewhere in, in uh, Ashland City. And uh, something is up with this attic. She seems to be very fascinated with this attic. And we're about to get into together as to why that is. So let's go ahead. And get right into this thing thing by liking the hit hit. Go. So, I just recently purchased a house on Main Street here in Ashland City. Here in Ashland City. And I am climbing up into the attic. I just want to show you guys what this attic looks like. Man, look how huge this attic is, man. Bruh. Dude, it's amazing. The attic was boarded off. And we were told that the attic was sealed because there was really no space. So I don't know if it's the previous owner or the real estate agent or whoever, but somebody told her that this attic was boarded off because there wasn't much space. Man, that looks like a whole nother room. You know what I'm saying? That you can have upstairs if you have a staircase. And speaking of staircases, she's about to get into that in a bit. But let's go ahead and get back into this thing. But look at this. It's absolutely beautiful up here. And you can see right here because I'm on a ladder in the kitchen. Look at this, man. You got an outlet that was over here, like towards the left end of my screen. Um, and then you have another outlet over here next to what appears to be a crawl space. And the ceilings are like, of course it needs some repairs, but we were not expecting it to be this nice. That is a really nice attic. I'm not going to lie. I mean, the wood paneling on there, if I can get this to focus, you know what? Let me check my HD settings. Completely sealed off. We had to... So yeah, um, I hope that's at least a little bit better. But yeah, the wood paneling here up in this attic, it is beautiful, man. This is gorgeous. It looks like at one at one point this could be like a playroom, you know what I mean, for like a little kid or something. Because look how it's painted. It's got this nice, beautiful sky blue, baby blue, you know, ceilings. And then you got the white trim and everything. That is nice. See, I'm looking at my outlet in my room, and I'm looking at versus the, the size of the outlets here. So, yeah, I would imagine, yeah, that is a pretty good size attic that you can do a lot of things with. Break through the wood to get into the top. But I want to show you guys just how big it is so you can understand what we're dealing with here. It's absolutely beautiful. There's really no way to get up here unless you climb this ladder that I'm on right now. Look at this ladder. And it looks like um, the opening is like near like what, what appears to be like the, the uh, sink and the oven. You know what I mean? Um, if she's planning on making that room accessible. And this is just, just a suggestion, just an idea. But I would um, seal off that entrance and maybe move the entrance somewhere where it's not in the kitchen you know for for health reasons you know what i mean because let's say you, you have kids running around up here or whatever if, if you want to make this like into like a rec room or something where the kids can run around 
play around or whatever, and they're gonna be jumping around or whatever. You don't want, you know, you don't want none, none of the uh, pieces of the ceiling to be sprinkling in on your food and whatnot. You know what I mean? I'm just saying. So I'm gonna climb up here and show you guys how big it is. My sons are gonna kill me if they know I've been up here in this attic without anybody being here. But, you know, I'm a country girl. My daddy was a painter. I used to run around the roof of our own house. Look at this. It's huge. That is I'm huge. Sure like 10 feet, 12 feet high right here. And there's some little cubbies over here. It is just the cutest place. I'm going to walk around and show you guys for a second. Be careful out there. The camera. Whoops, I can't because now I have no. I'm up here in the dark. <laughs> but yes, look at this. It's amazing. There's a little cubby hole over there. Mm. There's a little crawl space back there. A little spooky. Yeah. There's a couple of things laying here. It's a piece of paper. I mean, I was saying, you could probably make this a whole nother bedroom if you really wanted to. You know what I'm saying? Like, you can figure out where to put, like, like a bed somewhere and then, I don't know. Or maybe make, like, a like a rest. Maybe make, 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 make like, a, like, a little studio. You know what I'm saying? Have, like, a rest area somewhere where, you know, your bed and whatnot. And, and then maybe make, like, a... Like, and then have like an area because you got plenty of outlets so you can do like an area where you, it's like your office area you can have like a like a desk with a computer you know what i'm saying you could probably put a tv up there and whatnot have like a little en entertainment area you know what i'm saying like it that attic looks plenty big enough that where you can do something cool with it there's the chimney oh that's a chimney i thought that was just some some brick pillar right there but no that's actually a chimney okay there's another little cubby hole space back here. Mm -hmm. And that's a pretty big space. And you can literally just, just know the size that we're looking at. Right there, you could totally put a full-size mattress. You know what I'm saying? That's how big that space is right there. That would not be a bad place to put a full-size bed. I mean, I think that would be a nice little little area to have, have a bed. You know what I'm saying? Bruh. This is one of my lamps I put up here so that we would have light. And I don't know why it's not, who turned it off or why it's not working now, but. Might have to replace the bulb. Maybe, maybe the bulb or it could be the wiring. Maybe the wiring needs to be um, up, updated or something. I'm going to pull it out and take it downstairs with me. But right. Or that outlet could be faulty. Maybe that outlet needs repair. Right. Is it this crazy? I've got to get the wasp mess out of here though. Oh yeah, you definitely want to get them wasp nests out of there. Bruh, that that cannot be good. The floor, somewhere in this floor area, I'm going to see if I can get a contractor to come here. I mean, this space is just, I can't waste this space. It's so beautiful. I'm going to have to put like a spiral staircase going to the downstairs. Like Yo, a spiral staircase would be dope. But like I said, I don't know if I do it in, in, in the kitchen. Like I said, um... I would say, if anything, seal off this entrance here and put the spiral staircase like somewhere that's not in the kitchen. You know what I mean? Uh, just, just an idea. Again, just just throwing that out there. Um, or if you want to keep this opening as a, as a convenience, you could probably do something cool with that opening. You know what I mean? Like, oh, like maybe you you need something or whatever, and they can just use this to like you know pass down something to you. I don't know. I don't know. Or for emergencies, just keep that opening for emergencies. You know what I mean? Like, God forbid, should anything happen, and that's like your only means of escape. Then maybe do something with that opening to use it as like a, a an emergency escape or something. You know, bruh. But yeah, that is a nice attic. Because as you can see, I'm like I said, I'm up. I climbed this, up this ladder in my kitchen because that's where the attic space crawl space is, right above the stove, which is really strange. Yeah, see, and that, that's one of my concerns. Being that it's right above the stove, I would not have that opening above the stove. You know, because again, you know, just just for health reasons, I wouldn't have that opening there. 
that's what I'm saying. Maybe it may be best to seal off that opening and move it somewhere else. Again, just, just a suggestion. But yeah, so this is so much more square footage. It's absolutely beautiful. I agree. That That is a nice attic, man. That house is nice. I'm not going to lie. That, that, that looks like a really nice house. I can't wait to transform this into something. Anyways, I just wanted you guys to see it. So cool. I'm going to go back downstairs now before my son show up and kick my ass. <laughs> I don't know about all that, but hey, you can't blame your sons for being concerned about their mama. Obviously, they don't want nothing to happen to their mama, so I can't blame them, you know. Anyways, let me go ahead and get this a like before I forget. <clears throat> so, yeah, y'all, I just thought this was a really cool video to uh, share with y'all. You know what I mean? We're having a look at Miss Patty Lynn's new place. You know, her showing off her, her attic and everything, which does look lovely. Um, I hope that whenever she does um, decide to do, well, I mean, obviously, she's going to do something with it. Um, and I hope that, you know, whenever she does, with whatever she does with that room, maybe she'll be uh, willing to show us so that way we can do an updated uh, reaction video uh, to her newly completed attic. Cause yeah, man, I I'm excited for her, man. It, it looks like a nice attic. You could definitely do something nice. Like I said, maybe make it into like, like, like a little studio in that area where, where she said you could fit a full size bed, maybe put a full size bed there. Um, then maybe you utilize one of those outlets, one of those areas where the outlets is to put like, maybe like a desk with like a computer or something. So like, I don't know maybe if you have, if you want to use that, like as, as like a, like a guest room or something, you know, someone can have access to like a computer and then they have a rest area with the bed and everything, you know. I mean, yeah, I mean, I, I mean, either way, it's a nice attic and I can't wait to see what, what she does with it. If she's willing to show us, that'd be, that'd, that'd be cool, man. Anyways, y'all, that was Miss Patty Lynn showing off her new house and that lovely attic. She, and uh, yeah, went ahead, gave it a like because, yo, that's cool stuff. And if you guys want to show love, show support to Miss Patty Lynn, uh, the link for the original video, as always, will be in the description down below. You're more than welcome to hit that up whenever you like, however as many times as you like. You know what I'm saying? And go show Miss Patty Lynn some love. I'm sure she'll greatly appreciate that. And uh, yeah. <clears throat> Don't forget, guys, if you're here with this reaction, if you're feeling the vibes from this channel, y'all know y'all know what to do as far as like, uh, you know, the, the uh, liking, the commenting, the subscribing. And all that other fun stuff is concerned. Uh, don't forget to have the bell notifications on set to all so you never miss an upload. That would be greatly appreciated. And also, don't forget to check out all the links in the video description down below. Including the uh, two storefronts in my spring uh, merch store link. You know what I'm saying? That would be greatly, greatly appreciated. And uh, yeah, till the next one, it is your boy Jason JV's. And y'all have a blessed one. Catch y'all next one. Peace. <laughs>